How's it going everyone? We're about to do a 20 minute standing dumbbell workout. This is a full body routine with a super quick warm up and cool down included. Today I'll be using two 10 pound dumbbells and the intervals for your workout will be 45 seconds on and 15 seconds rest. So find some space and get ready to sculpt. All right, let's get our warm up started with high knee taps. Good, standing as tall as you can. Let's get the body moving. Here we go. All right, we have squat, reach down, into a twist, squat, twist the other way. All right, bend through those elbows, open through the chest, then scoop through the belly, close through the front body here. Open and close. Good, open and lift, close and scoop. All right, let's get into our workout now, grabbing both dumbbells. And we have squat right into single press. Squat, single press, other arm. Here we go. Send those hips back and down. Good, strong through the core as we press overhead. All right, take a quick break. Next up, we have pulse, then full shoulder press, palms forward. Let's go. Good, soften through those knees, shoulders down, lengthen through the neck. Good, work the shoulders. Okay, we have sumo stance, step a bit wider, slightly turned out, and we have sumo squat, slow lower, nice and slow before we come back up. All right. Good, knees tracking in the same direction as those toes, pressing them out to the side, make sure we're super slow on that lower before we extend.
Okay, for our next move here, uh, step the left leg back. We have a pulse two in that lunge, then lean forward, two tricep extensions. All right, let's go. Pulse two, lean forward, flat back, elbows back, working the triceps. Same thing, other side. Right leg steps back, two pulse in that lunge, body is upright, then lean forward for the tricep extensions. Here we go, right leg back, pulse, two straighten out the back leg, tricep extensions, you got it. Okay, get rid of one of those dumbbells. We have press forward, then twist knee. Press forward, twist knee. Okay, press into that dumbbell. Good. Work the core as we twist. Good. Resist. All right, switching your grip on that dumbbell, hold it like so. We're gonna do goblet squat step outs. So step to the side, back in, step the other side, back in. Dumbbell comes into the right hand, other arms to this side, and we have two half bicep curls. So starting with that bent elbow, right leg comes behind you, diagonally across into a curtsy lunge. Let's go. Two half curls, right leg back, step back together. because you're holding, holding that elbow in a bent position there for the curtsy. Good. Keeping the engagement on the biceps.
switch it into the left hand. Same thing, other arm is out to the side. We have two half curls. Step diagonally behind you with your left leg. All right. Grab your other dumbbell. And we just have hammer curls. So palms are facing in, nice and slow, nice and controlled. With those hammer curls, we're gonna do a burnout on those biceps. All right. Good, remember to exhale as you curl and bend through the elbows. Inhale to extend. Use your breath throughout the workout here. Next movement, bend through the knees and lean forward with a flat back and we have two wide flies. Then single row it back nice and slow. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. Let's do it. Good, so you are lifted and supported through those elbows. Don't let them droop. Good. Slow it down with those wide flies, working the back of the shoulders. Get amazing for those postural muscles. Okay, taking it into a wide second. Feet are super wide, turned out from the hips, body is upright. You're gonna lower, lift one heel, extend lower, lift the other heel. Good, now that heel lift is optional there. Good, always making the workout your own, always modifying if needed, or making it more challenging if needed for yourself. Add some extra holds, extra pulses. Good, whatever you need for your own body. Okay, so we have deadlifts. Slight bend through those knees, flat back as we hinge at the hips, two of those into a full squat, bend through the knees. Okay, two deadlifts, nice and slow. And suitcase squat.
Dumbbells are together. Let's work the triceps a little bit. And we have two tricep extensions overhead, then two presses overhead, dumbbells together. Okie dokie. Okay, next up, lateral shoulder raise straight into a hammer curl. So soften through the elbows. You're keeping them nice and supported for that lateral raise. Let's go. All right, drop one of your dumbbells. Dumbbell comes into the right hand here and we have a side lunge out with the left leg. Reach down, long flat back, then optional knee lift here as we press overhead. Here we go. Lengthen. Good, get taller for that press. Good, make sure we're not hunching over as we reach for the ground there. Roll those shoulders down and back, keep an open chest. Good. All right, switching sides, dumbbells in the left hand, stepping out with the right leg. Side lunge, good, grow tall. Okay, this is your final move. We have squat pulse and then cross tap back. Actually, let's hold the dumbbell like this. Squat pulse, then come up for a cross tap back. Here we go. Good, this is your last move, which means you can get lower than that. Pulse even slower. Good, challenge yourself. Good, finish with those pulses. 
All right, drop the dumbbell. Shake it out, let's cool down. Okay, right arm across the body, pull it towards you. Good, stretch out the back of those shoulders. And switch sides, other arm. All right, inhale. Exhale, forward fold, soften through the knees slightly and relax through that head. Bend through the knees and roll on up. Quad stretch with your right leg. Good, holding on to something if needed. Good, zip up through the front body. Draw those knees together, hips forward. And switch sides. And release, step together, two final breaths. Inhale, reach up. And exhale, one more. Inhale. Exhale. Shake it out, and you made it. All right, amazing work, everyone. Comment below to let me know if you wanna see more standing workouts like this one. If you felt the burn, then hit the like button subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in the next one.